What's going on, everyone? It's Dark Strider, the YouTube assassin. And over here in the United States, it is Thanksgiving Day. It is a day where a bunch of colonizers got together. And we're very thankful to the natives right before they just decided to kill them all and whatnot. Uh, you know, they helped them survive and then turn around and... So... It's kind of crazy. Anyway, it's tradition over here that if you can in this economy afford a turkey and all the trimmings and whatnot, that you kind of do that and you're thankful for everything that has happened in your life for the past year. So that's what I'm doing. I'm in charge of cooking the turkey and the trimmings and everything this year. So I don't have a lot of time to spend making videos. Therefore, you're seeing a bunch of items that are pre-recorded like the god of war games and of course i'm pre-recording this so that way i could give it to you um i most likely will do an assassin's creed valhalla video later on in which i show you guys what's going on because it is excuse me going to be the opal reset so uh you know i'll definitely do that anyway Happy Thanksgiving, and for today, I think I'm going to spend the next hour telling you guys jokes. Some of them will be funny jokes, some of them will be dad jokes. Hopefully you laugh. So sit back, relax. Um, you probably don't want to play this in front of your parents. And uh, speaking of parents, it's not just the turkey that's getting stuffed. So is your mom. I'll be there later. Anyway, here we go, everyone. <laughs> And just so that you guys know, by the way, in the background, I am playing Super Turkey Puncher 3, which is available in Doom 3, as well as the remake of Doom from 2016. Anyway, here we go. So, uh, I prepared Thanksgiving for guests from out of town. I cooked for many hours using recipes I'd found, but the turkey, I confess was not a golden brown. I made a huge mistake and cooked it upside down. Eh, not as funny, and some of you guys have uh, sent me these, so it is what it is. What would you get if you crossed a turkey with a ghost? A poultry geist. Get it? Because it's poultry and it's a ghost. Poultry geist. Eh. Rate these jokes, by the way, because I'm going to kill the uh, team that actually gave these for me. Why did the police arrest the turkey? They suspected foul play. Why did the turkey cross the road twice? To prove he wasn't a chicken. What happened when the turkey got into a fight? He got the stuff and knocked out of him. Hmm, wouldn't happen to me. What key won't open any door? A Turk E. Badoom boom chan. Uh, what did the mother turkey say to her disobedient children? If your father could see you now, he'd turn over in his grave. Yeah, let that sink in for a minute. Anyway, what kind of weather does a turkey like? Foul weather. What is the best dance to do on Thanksgiving? The turkey trot. I mean, me, the best dance is after you eat, just to have the itis and do the unbutton of the uh, pants and just let your fat flag fly, homie. I just sit back and relax. And that's what I'm going to do after I'm done cooking all this crap. I hope my family is appreciative. If you call a large turkey a gobbler, what do you call a small one? A goblet. But a boom chain. Who is not hungry at Thanksgiving? That is a stupid question, everybody, because everybody wants to eat. But that's not the answer. The answer is the turkey, because he's already stuffed. By the way, I want to give a shout out to all the uh, service members of the United States that can't be here for Thanksgiving. Uh, Mid 40s gamer, good friend of the channel. He probably won't be home for Thanksgiving. He's actually out training, uh, you know, certain small groups. And I can't tell you where and whatnot because, uh, you know, you're not privy to that knowledge. But 
you know, he's, he's just out with the troops. He's training. Um, you know, I hope he has a Thanksgiving, as do all our service members. As do service members everywhere. Anybody who is working today, anybody who is a police officer, a fire person, an EMT, anything like that, you know, I really do wish you guys a happy Thanksgiving. Um, I hope it goes out without a hitch. I hope that there are no fights or anything that you have to go to. Uh, those scenes are grim. And um, someone very special to me actually lost their mother uh, yesterday, the day before Thanksgiving. So, um, you know, anybody who's lost a loved one, you know, like my heart seriously does go out to you. And, you know, like uh, my prayers are with your family. So, you know, I hope that you guys do have, you know, a, a kind of blessed Thanksgiving where you're actually thankful for the lives that you have and what you've got going on and whatnot. And, uh, you know, that's just a, a heartfelt statement that I wanted to give you. Um, and now back to the jokes. Why should you never set the turkey next to the dessert? Because he will gobble, gobble, gobble it up. What sound does a turkey's phone make? Wing, 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 wing. Like, get it? Turkey, wing? Yeah. No? Not feeling it? Yeah, me neither. Anyway, what's the most musical part of a turkey? The drumstick. And you need those drumsticks so you could go ba boom boom chang Oh, uh, let's see. What is a turkey's favorite dessert? Peach gobbler. What sound does a limping turkey make? Wobble wobble. What do you call it when it rains turkeys? Foul weather. I'd call it the end of the world. I'd, I'd be pretty pissed off if I saw turkeys just falling from the sky, man. Actually, with the economy the way it is currently, it might be a good thing. Just take one of them suckers, knock them out, kill them, cook them up, defeather them, do what you gotta do. What is the key to a great Thanksgiving dinner? The turf. Why can't you take a turkey to church? They use foul language. Well, so do I. That's why I don't go to church. I use foul language all the time. Anyway, what is it called when a turkey fumbles in football? A foul play. Fruit comes from a fruit tree. So where does turkey come from? A pole tree. Poultry? That doesn't sound right. Speaking of poultry, shout out to all the strippers. I hope you guys are having a wonderful Thanksgiving as well. Um, I'll be there later. Why shouldn't you look at the turkey dressing? Because it will make him blush. How are a turkey, a donkey, and a monkey alike? They all have keys. Which side of the turkey has the most feathers? The outside. Well, not the inside. Not the left, not the right. Yeah, I, I swear I see you guys just looking at me and rolling your eyes in disgust. <laughs> Why do turkeys like, what do turkeys like to do on sunny days? Have peck mix. Why do turkeys lay eggs? Because if they dropped them, they would break. So they gotta lay them. Get it? Get it? Get it? I wonder how big turkey eggs are. Why did the turkey refuse dessert? He was stuffed. I know. I said that kind of sexy. It is what it is. Anyway, what's a turkey's favorite month? They don't have one, but they prefer any other than November. What did the turkey say to the turkey hunter? on Thanksgiving Day. Quack, quack. Get it? He quack? Instead of gobble? Is that way the hunter didn't think he was a turkey, thought it was a duck? So I don't know how you can make that mistake. It's kind of crazy. Why did the farmer have to separate the chicken and the turkey? He sensed foul play. What key has legs and can't open a door? 
a turkey. Why did they let the turkey join the band? Because he had his own drumsticks. But um boom check. I swear I you know what? I see you guys. I see you through your phone, through your TV, through your laptop, through your monitor, and I see you guys just giving me the stink eye right now. I see you rolling your eyes. I see you like saying dark this isn't it bro this isn't it i see it i see it i hear it i feel it i'm sorry i apologize come on you're gonna use some of these yeah you are what happened to the turkey that got in a fight he got the not the stuffing knocked out of him of course he did you know you overdid it at thanksgiving when you thought the serving size for turkey was one listen I better not be the only one eating this damn turkey. This thing is going to be juicy. It's going to be delicious. I'm going to be day drinking. I'm going to be night drinking. I'm going to be just losing my mind with this damn thing. Why shouldn't you sit a turkey next to you at dinner? Because he will gobble the dinner up. That's kind of messed up. Some of these jokes are similar. What the hell? What do you call a running turkey? fast food yeah could you imagine going to mcdonald's on thanksgiving day and ordering like a big turkey could you is that a thing anybody that works at mcdonald's please hit me up in the comments let me know if that's a thing what do you guys do on thanksgiving i know you guys are still open i mean you know corporations are heartless they'll make you work it doesn't matter in fact i was working for a customer service company way back in the day i will not tell you what customer service i was working for but they wanted me to work on christmas morning now it was a phone company they wanted me to work christmas morning because they figured that people are opening their christmas presents they're getting brand new phones and they're gonna need to call people up to you know kind of like get the phones working and whatnot and uh my reaction to that company was, that's not my problem if they can't get their phones to work. They could call the day after Christmas. I told them, I says, you are not robbing me of seeing my loved ones on Christmas morning, offering them gifts, opening that stuff up, seeing their smiles and whatnot. I, I, that was the first time ever I did not call into work and I did not show up. I literally was a no call, no show. Nobody said anything. I was like, there's no shot. I'm not doing it. Nah. Didn't show up at all that day. Didn't even come in later. I, uh, you know, I, I should have got fired that day, but I was such a productive worker that, you know, they, they didn't even mention it to me. They didn't even want to uh, bring it up. So, you know, just to let you guys know that even though you are an employee, you still do have power. Remember that. What's blue and covered in feathers? A turkey holding its breath. What's the best song to play while cooking a turkey? I actually like this. It's uh, all about that bass. I, I could see that. Is it like a, a Megan Drumstick that sings it? Or a, you know Turkey Trainer? I don't know. But could you imagine? Oh man, Weird Al, you gotta parry that, bro. Because I'm all about that bass, about that bass. Yeah, I am. Oh, why did the turkey cross the road? He wanted people to think he was a chicken. Why was the turkey put in jail? The police suspected foul play. I know some of you are like, either laughing or you, you already got these jokes. I know, I know. I know you do. What did the turkey say to the computer? Google, Google. Get it? Google, Google, Google. Instead of gobble, gobble. Google, Google. You know what? I spit in your eye. How do you like that? I see you rolling those eyes. What do you get if you cross a turkey with a ghost? A poultry geist. I said this one already. Uh, what did the leftover turkey say? 
make me a sandwich. That is not something that I ask Lady Strider to do. She will freaking elbow smash me if I ever ask her to make me a sandwich. If she's feeling nice, she decides to do that. Other than that, nah, nah, don't fight with her. What side dish do you bring for Thanksgiving dinner when you accidentally sat on the sweet potatoes? Squash casserole. Heavy on the ass in squash casserole because you sat on the sweet potatoes. The hell? What role do green beans play in the Thanksgiving dinner? The casserole. I'm not a big green beans fan. I'm not a fan of this joke. And right now, you are not a fan of me either. Telling these messed up jokes. What's Frankenstein's favorite Thanksgiving dish? Monster mashed potatoes and grave. Yeah, soak that in for a second. I know you're upset. Why was the Thanksgiving soup so expensive? It had 24 carat. 24 carat magic in that soup. I'm trying to save it. I'm sorry. I apologize. I really do apologize. <laughs> Why did the cranberries turn red? Because they saw the turkey dressing. I see you rolling your eyes. <laughs> My grandma made mashed potatoes from a box. That's it. That's the joke. She made mashed potatoes from a box. Instead of fresh. You got it? You get it? Come on. Don't 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 look at me in that tone of voice. Come on. Come on! Come on. What do you wear to Thanksgiving dinner? A har vest. Get it? Get it? There you go. Why didn't the cook season the Thanksgiving turkey? There was no time. No T H Y N E time. It's also another joke that I've done with that where I've, you know, thrown a bunch of time on the palm of my hand and I said, I got nothing but time on my hands. Oh, <laughs> I know, poor joke, poor joke. I'm sorry. I apologize. It is what it is. Here, look, I'm going to have a drink right now. Go. These jokes are terrible. <laughs> but you're still having fun. What's a turkey's favorite Thanksgiving food? Nothing. It's already stuffed. What holiday is Dracula's favorite? Thanksgiving. There you go, rolling your eyes again. You know what? You know what? You know what? I deserve it. I do. I do. What instrument does a turkey play? The drumsticks. What kind of key cannot open doors? A tur key. You got it. You already knew the answer. You just said it right now. I know. I hear you. What sound does a dizzy turkey make? Wobble, wobble. This is dizzy. It's wobbling. You got it? You got it? You're mad at me. I'm sorry. I apologize. <laughs> what did Han Solo say to Luke Skywalker on Thanksgiving? Star Wars joke, everyone. Star Wars joke incoming. For all you nerd fans. I'm a nerd fan of Star Wars. I absolutely love it. So uh, I'm going to use this one later. I'm going to tell this to Lady Strider, who's also a dark, uh, 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 whole fan of Star Wars. What did Han Solo say to Luke Skywalker on Thanksgiving? May the forks be with you. And hopefully the knives and the spoons and everything else that you need to eat a Thanksgiving dinner. 
What kind of music did the pilgrims listen to? Plymouth Rock. If April showers brings May flowers, what do May flowers bring? The pilgrims. Right before the earth. Why didn't the pilgrim want to make the bread? It's a crummy job. What do you call the age of a pilgrim? Pilgrimage. Pilgrimage. I know you're angry. I'd rather play Dragon Age myself. It's a lot more fun than pilgrims did. Um, why do pilgrim's pants always fall down? Because they wear their buckles on their hats. They also wear them on their shoes, don't they? Did they not invent belts? Did they not know that belts were a thing? Did they... I don't know. It's kind of crazy. Oh! We got a John Wayne joke! John Wayne, for all you youngins, was a uh, person who starred in a bunch of kind of like uh, World War, Vietnam, and especially Western movies. He always played a cowboy. That's how I remember him. I always thought it was weird when I saw him in a uh, movie that involved, you know, Vietnam or World War I, World War II, anything like that. Uh, you know, he was a, a good actor, racist guy, real racist guy. Very good actor, though. Um, <laughs> anyway. What's John Wayne's favorite holiday? Thanksgiving, Pilgrim. I mean, you probably won't get that because, like, he... That was part of, like, his westerns. He always called people Pilgrim. He would be like, no, no, go out there and punch that guy in the face, Pilgrim. That's how he used to talk. Anyway, I'm, again, sorry. And if you don't know who he is and you don't know the joke... I'll do better next year, I promise. I absolutely promise. Knock, knock. Who's there? Normally. Normally. Normally, I don't drink and eat this much. Yeah. We all do it today. I'm sorry, people. I'm sorry. Knock, knock. Who's there? Tamara. Tamara, who? Tomorrow we'll eat all the leftovers. That's what's actually going to happen. I'm going to have sandwiches for days. I'm going to have turkey sandwiches. I'm not a big fan of vegetables. I'm not a big fan of a lot of stuff. But you give me turkey. Listen, I had an ex-girlfriend that used to get really mad at me because, like, she would say that all I need for a meal is bread, meat, cheese, and some sort of dressing. And that was it. That was all I eat. Hamburgers, hot dogs sandwiches, anything with meat it, I used to eat. I, I hated vegetables. Uh, you know, I'm big and strong right now. Without vegetables, I eat, you know, I take uh, vitamins and other supplements and whatnot. So, uh, I, I'm sorry to all the, anyone who's got kids, do not listen to me. Eat your vegetables. Do as your parents say. Always make sure they eat that stuff so you can be big and strong and be a uh, YouTuber and, and do videos that are you know, funny most of the time and probably not funny when you're doing a holiday special because you didn't have time to actually do video. And don't drink. Don't drink alcohol. It's very bad for you. Very, very bad. Anyway, let's keep going. Knock, knock. Who's there? Don. Don who? Don, eat all the gravy. I want some more. Wait, we've got musical jokes. I'm all about that bass. I'm, I'm actually gonna use that. I, I really am. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be eating the turkey. I'm gonna be saying that throughout the day. I'm all about that bass. That'll be funny. Uh, stop, drop, and pass the rolls. My family told me to stop telling Thanksgiving jokes, but I said I couldn't quit cold turkey pretty sure a lot of you are begging me right now to quit cold turkey 
on these jokes. And I'm sorry. <laughs> you don't know how bad I feel. I mean, not that bad, but I, I imagine all of you like being like, just like dark. What the hell are you doing, bro? What the hell are you doing right now, bro? I get it. And to all the ladies out there, especially your mom, I only have pies for you. I know, that was terrible. That was terrible. I know some of you are like, when he takes those dramatic pauses, I I'm hoping he's just passing out or something. <laughs> Hey, I just met you, and this is gravy, but here's my stuffing, so carve me, maybe. Guys, some of you sent these jokes in. So, whatever you are saying to me, I am going to say to them, they're going to get lambasted, lambasted. My cat is looking at me like I am the whole mental patient right now. He is looking at me like even he understands that some of these jokes are not funny. That some of them are ridiculous. He is looking at me with disgust, with disdain. Absolute disdain. Anyway. Uh, here's something I don't often say. Especially when drinking alcohol. Let's get basted. I, I, yeah, the little slap. I'm sorry. Gobble till you wobble. Oh my gourd, I ate too much. People, again, I am so sorry you do not understand. I know some of you are like, no, you're not sorry because you keep going because you've been doing this for a half hour and you're going to keep doing it. You mother effer. I am seriously sorry. Though. I, I really am. Um, what do Thanksgiving and Halloween have in common? One has gobblers. The other has goblins. I know. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What did the turkey say to the computer? We already got this one. Google, Google, Google. Instead of gobble, gobble, gobble. Get it? Get it? Get it? What's a pumpkin's favorite sport? Squash. What kind of face does a pilgrim make when he's in pain or listening to Dark Strider telling jokes right now? Pilgrimus. Like all of you are doing, you are all grimacing right now. I know you are. Uh, what is the best way to stuff a turkey? Serve him lots of pizza and ice cream. You know what? That's what I should have done instead of making this damn turkey. This is kind of great. You know what? Uh, I mean, do they offer pizza and Thanksgiving? On? I think pizza places are closed today. I think Chinese places are still uh, open though. Just order Chinese. What do you get if you divide the circumference of a pumpkin by its diameter? Pumpkin pie. And pie is just spelled P-I, which is 3.14. Some of you, you math nerds are, I, I know you're slapping your phone right now. I know you're slapping the PC right now. What do you call a holiday dinner without the parents? Friendsgiving. I have a lot of friends coming over too. But I do have Mama and Papa Strider coming by and they're gonna eat their asses off. Uh, you know, Mama Strider, she didn't have to cook this year. I decided to cook. Uh, I am actually an excellent cook, believe it or not. I am pretty good as a uh, culinary culinarian I'm, I'm very good at cooking I'm very good at uh, making all kinds of things desserts uh, you know it's like one of my secret talents it's one of my hidden talents you know obviously telling jokes right now is not the talent <laughs> although normally I do tell some awesome jokes but today today we're messing up you know just, just because 
If pilgrims traveled on the Mayflower, what do students, college students, travel on? If pilgrims traveled on the Mayflower, what do college students travel on? Scholarships. Get it? Scholar. Scholar. Got it. Got it. Do not shoot the messenger, please. Uh, what smells the best at Thanksgiving dinner? Your nose. Your nose is smelling everything, every delicious, delectable item. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'll tell you one thing, though. I don't put my Christmas tree up this weekend, even though it's Thanksgiving. I'll put it up December 1st. I might put it up the week before Christmas. Although, I had a bunch of wreaths around the house with pictures of the actor who played Khan in uh, the Star Trek, The Wrath of Khan. Or I have wreaths that have a bunch of the little action figures of the actor who played Khan in Star Trek. And uh, I always tell people that I call that the wreath of Khan instead of the wrath of Khan. Some people get it, some people don't. Some people are looking at me like you're looking at the phone or the TV or the computer screen right now. <laughs> but I also have a, a couple of uh, bombs. I have, uh, and they're named after Star Wars and Star Trek references as well. I have the Wrath of Bong and I have the Dagobah, named after Wrath of Kong and Dagobah from. Star Trek and Star Wars, respectively. Yeah, sorry. Sorry, sorry! What did the turkey say before it was roasted? Boy, I'm stuffed. What's a turkey's favorite Thanksgiving food? Nothing. It's already stuffed. What happened to the turkey that got into a fight? He got the stuff and knocked out him. What did the pilgrim wear to dinner? A har vest. And a bunch of belt buckles on everything but their belt, apparently. That is... I don't... I don't know. Anyway. When is the turkey soup bad for your health? It's actually a good question, because I always say the soup is good for your health. But when is the turkey soup bad for your health? When you are the tur in the turkey suit. I know, I'm sorry guys. I, I, I'm not that sorry because I keep, <laughs> keep going. <laughs> if you lasted this far, I think it's absolutely amazing though. Alright, so moving on. Why did the turkey cross the road? It was the chicken's day off. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. A lot of these jokes seem to be repeats. A lot of you guys who uh, kind of sent some jokes in. I'm reading and uh, it's, it's very similar. What does Thanksgiving have in common with Halloween? Gobble ins. Who scared the can the cranberry? Who scared the cranberry? The blueberry. <laughs> More knock knock jokes. Knock knock. Who's there? Dewey who? Wait, I messed that up. Knock knock. <laughs> Who's there? Dewey. Dewey who? There we go. Do we have to wait long to eat? I know you wish I skipped that. I'm sorry. If your great grandmother saw you making boxed mashed potatoes, she would turn over in her gravy. You know what's like really crazy? Is like I'm making everything fresh. I don't even eat mashed potatoes, and I am mashing the ever-living mash out of these potatoes. Really am. 
So I hope my whole family appreciates this nonsense. What do you call a pilgrim's vocabulary? Pill grammar. Grammar's dying art, by the way. Kids, make sure you read daily. I don't care if it's a magazine. I don't care if it's a newspaper. Really, let's get these kids reading because honestly, it's not a joke. Reading is fundamental. And honestly, you will expand your vocabulary exponentially if you read daily. Read stuff that interests you. When I was in high school, I didn't like reading whatever they gave us. It was always like crap books that like I didn't care about from like authors that I didn't care about. But honestly, always read. I read daily now. I read a bunch of things that like I'm into. Uh, you know, don't read Facebook and Twitter because your, your mind is going to rot. It's going to be like really bad because nobody can spell on any of those forums. Read actual books. Read stuff that you're interested in. Right now, I am rereading the book series, A Tale of Fire and Ice. You might know it as A Game of Thrones, but, spoiler alert, fun fact, Game of Thrones was the first book in the series. And then it was different names for different things. And um, again, the entire series is called A, A Tale of Fire and Ice. And um, I'm actually enjoying it. I'm on the third book now. And uh, started reading this series again, or rereading the series. I want to say maybe, maybe a couple of weeks ago, maybe two, three weeks. Once you get into the book and you love the book, you just fly through it. So, just, you know. Oh, here's one for you guys. My family, I want to say my viewers, my viewers told me to, top, to stop telling Thanksgiving jokes and turkey jokes. But I told them I couldn't quit cold turkey. I know a bunch of you are praying that I do. And what are you doing? It's almost over, people. It's almost over. You got, like, maybe less than 20 minutes left on this. Why do turkeys gobble? Because they never learn table manners. Not that they gobble, that they gobble everything. You know, like... They, Thanksgiving, man. Not a good day to be in my pants. <laughs> I actually like that one. <laughs> Thanksgiving, man. Not a good day to be in my pants. Oh, let's see. A new survey found that 80% of men claim they help cook Thanksgiving dinner. Which makes sense when you hear they... What? Wait. Wait, 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 wait. I gotta start this over because this doesn't make it. This isn't worded correctly. Okay, hold on. A new survey found that 80% of men claim they help cook Thanksgiving dinner. Which makes sense when you hear they consider saying, that smells good to be helping. They, you get it? Like, they help by saying that smells good? Uh, well, you know, I'm not part of this 80%. I'm not helping to cook. I'm actually cooking. I'm probably like one of like the 5%. Shout out to all the guys who are cooking, all the dads, all the single men, all the, the anybody who is out there cooking. And shout out to all you women who are just amazing, always. Thanksgiving. It's like we didn't even try to come up with the tradition. The tradition is we overeat. Hey, how about a Thanksgiving we just eat a lot? But we do that every day. Oh, what if we eat a lot with people that annoy the hell out of us? That actually, that's 
accurate. That's pretty accurate. I do have a bunch of people coming over to the house that I don't like that my parents decided to invite because they feel the need to include them. Those annoying family members. Knock, knock! Who's there? Arthur. Arthur who? Arthur, any leftovers? How many of you are actually going to take leftovers from Thanksgiving or be giving leftovers or give out leftovers? Because that's a big thing that I do. I want to get rid of it all. I don't want to eat turkey for like a week afterwards. And you know how you're always obligated to do that. You have to do that. Because you just made dinner. You just ate dinner. You ate a whole bunch of pies and cakes and everything like that. And you don't want to eat that stuff. You don't even want to look at it. You don't even want to look at it. You just want to get rid of it. Who is not hungry at Thanksgiving? The turkey. Because he's already stuffed. I know I said that before. I'm sure you got it. You guys got it. How did the salt and pepper welcome all the guests? By saying seasonings greetings. They're seasoning. They're greeting. Okay. I know you got it. You're, you're not dumb. You, you got it. You look at me like I'm dumb. Thanksgiving dinners take 18 hours to prepare. They're consumed in 12 minutes. Half times take 12 minutes. This is not a coincidence. Ooh. That's a fact. Nice little American football joke in there. Because half time is 12 minutes. <laughs> That makes sense. When do you serve tofu turkey? Pranksgiving. Um, gotta admit, I am not a tofu fan. I, I definitely am not a tofu fan. The first time a friend served tofu to me, I thought they were trying to kill me. I was ready to call the police because I thought they, I literally thought that the food was poison. I had no idea. No offense to anybody who actually enjoys uh, tofu. I'm not trying to knock you. Um, it's just not my thing. It really is not my thing. It definitely is. But I know some people are going to make tofurkeys and vegan Thanksgivings and stuff like that. Uh, I am not into the, the vegan lifestyle or the, uh, the tofu thing. I am carnivorous and, you know, I hope you're not offended by that. And uh, I know that there are some crazy vegans like the vegan teacher who's a little too extra, who says we're murdering everything and whatnot. And, you know, it, it, to those people I say, listen, don't wear clothes then. Your clothes are made from animals. You, you know, like fabric is made from animals you know all kinds of stuff like that like it, it, it's made from nature so you just run around naked and, and die in the cold if, if you're going to be that extra but if you're going to eat you know vegan you're going to eat the vegan lifestyle you're going to eat tofu and stuff like that you know um to each their own and i will respect that and you know like it, there are a bunch of dishes that i am making because i do have vegan family coming over which is kind of like wild but um you know for them i do have a lot of uh kind of a, a vegetable and fruit dishes um as well as you know like anything that is not made from animals you know so that they can enjoy they can partake they could still sit down and, and eat with us and, and not feel weird because they're still eating something you know they don't have to bring their own stuff which I've been to barbecues where family has brought, you know, d special uh, uh, hamburgers that were made from, you know, like uh, kind of like vegetables and stuff like that. And, um, you know, if that's what you want to do, that's what you want to do, you know. So uh, by all means, everyone, you know, please respect your family, even if you think they're weird. 
you know, I have family that's actually annoying. There will probably be a battle in my home. And uh, if there is, I will live stream it, trust me, because it is going to be epic. Because I have a cousin coming over, I don't like this cousin, and I'm probably gonna like drop kick this mofo, and it, it will turn into a battle royale. You will see like Strider Battle 9 or whatever. It's it's gonna be crazy, all right? If that happens, I promise I will uh, I will live stream. Um, let's get back to the jokes that are horrible anyway. Why should you never set the turkey next to the dessert? Because he will gobble it up. I, I know. That's, that's just, it's crap. I'm sorry. Why do turkeys hate the kitchen on Thanksgiving? It smells foul. What do you call gossiping with a turkey at the table? You call it a side dish, girl. What didn't have any friends at Friendsgiving? The turkey. What does the turkey think about the holidays? They're about family time. After that, it's all gravy. Why are turkeys good at rebelling? They love a coop. Chicken coop, turkey coop. Love a coop. <laughs> Why did the turkey run across the road? It was time for dinner. Hold on, there's a bunch of like uh, ones that I've already read to you guys. Uh, la, 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 la. Why do turkeys hate Thanksgiving tables? They're a foul sight. What do you call a turkey the day after Thanksgiving? Lucky. Because <laughs> he lived. What sound does a turkey's phone make? Wing, wing, wing. What was the turkey thankful for on Thanksgiving? Vegetarians. Can a turkey jump higher than a house? Yes, because houses can't jump. Why do turkeys love rainy days? They love foul weather. <laughs> what do turkeys only, or no, hold on, why? Do turkeys only star in R-rated movies? Because they use foul language. There's a lot more jokes, apparently. You guys are pretty... You guys have a lot of uh, turkey jokes that are apparently are pretty popular. Pretty, pretty popular. Okay, hold on. What is going on? Knock, knock! Who's there? Hank! Hank who? Hanksgiving is here! Knock knock! Who's there? Harry! Harry who? Harry up! It's time to feast! <laughs> knock knock! Who's there? Annie! Annie who? Anybody seen the turkey? Knock, knock. Who's there? Olive. Olive who? I love the turkey stuffing. Do you know where you could get turkey stock in bulk? The stock market. What do you tell your jokester cousin on Thanksgiving? You're on a casserole. What did the president say when presented with a poorly cooked turkey? Is it too late for a party? What does grandma say when you burn the holiday meal? Oh, good lady. How did you find grandma's turkey this year? I just looked next to the gravy. What side dish do you bring for Thanksgiving dinner? And you accidentally sat on the sweet potatoes. We said this already. Squash casserole. Uh, wow, there are lots of popular jokes, apparently. What vegetables would you like with your Thanksgiving dinner? Beats me. Beats. B-E-E-T-S. Uh -huh. 
Yeah, I went there. I did. Why did the policeman stop you on your way home last Thanksgiving? Because you far exceeded your feed limit. What the? There are a bunch of... Okay, will I eat leftovers for a week? I cram and I will. The stuffing is the turkey to my heart. What do you call an attractive pilgrim? A Puritan. Get it? Puritan. 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 Yeah. I just call him sexy. Oh. <laughs> what, what kind of tan did the pilgrims get at the beach? Puritan. What do pilgrims use to bake cookies? Mayflower. What is the smallest unit of measurement in the Pilgrim cookbook? A pilgram. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> I know these were horrible. <laughs> anyway, that's all there is to this video. Uh, you know, like, I, I hope you guys don't hate me afterwards. I hope you actually did enjoy it, that you did like it. And uh, if you want me to do this every year, this can be an annual thing. Uh, you know, feel free to, uh, you know, comment in the comments below. If you don't want me to ever do this again, <laughs> also put it in the comments below. I really did hope you had fun. If you have any other jokes, by all means, drop them in the comments. And maybe I'll read them next year. Because we'll do this again. We'll have all new jokes or something like that. And if you want to uh, go and do any other holiday jokes, by all means, drop those as well. Uh, you know, maybe we could do this at Christmas. Maybe we could do this for New Year's. Maybe we could do this whenever. And again, keep tuned to this channel. I am still going to do the Assassin's Creed Valhalla thing. Uh, you know, it is the Opal Reset today. And I'm still going to drop you off, uh, you know, like whatever Retta has today. Hopefully it's not crap. It might be crap. He's been giving us a lot of crap. So maybe it'll be good this time. But um, we'll definitely, definitely, uh, uh, you know, do something else in between cooking. I mean, that turkey is going to be there all day. And uh, a lot of the side dishes I, I do after I do at least one video. Uh, you know, so I'll be able to do that and whatnot. But, you know, once again, I, I really do hope you enjoyed the video. I'm sorry if you didn't, but please, if you haven't already, like and subscribe. It helps this channel out an awful lot. As always, I want to thank each and every one of you for watching. And I want to especially thank all of you who lasted this long in the video. After all those horrible, horrible jokes. You're the real winners. You're the champions. I'm telling you. And if you did last the whole video, definitely let me know in the comments below. Maybe I'll have a contest where I actually, you know, like send you guys like a $25 gift card or something. Because you survived this long. Uh, you know, to like your favorite uh, platform, you know, like PC, uh, Steam, Xbox, PlayStation. Uh, uh, maybe even, you know, like a Nintendo Switch. Uh, you know, like you guys, <laughs> you're amazing. You're a champion if you lasted this long. Anyway, again, uh, you know, thank you all for watching. Until next time, be good, stay safe, take care of each other. I'll see you guys all in the next one. And I hope that you all have a very, very special Thanksgiving if you celebrate it today. And if you don't celebrate it today, I still hope you have an absolutely incredible day. And again, thank you guys for testing this. <laughs>